Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this triangle ABC. As you can see in this uh, diagram, such that uh, this uh, side length uh, AB equal to this side length uh, CD. And moreover, this angle uh, CAD is uh, 4x. This angle uh, ACD is uh, 2 times x. And finally, this angle uh, BCD is uh, just x. Now we are going to find the value of our angle uh, x. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And since we are dealing with this uh, challenging kind of problem, so therefore we are going to think uh, outside the box uh, and we are going to justify each and every step. So therefore we are going to draw these two auxiliary lines AE and BE such that we assume that this angle AEB is 3 times x. Now we can see if this angle is 3x and this whole angle is 2x plus x is going to make 3x as well. So that means this side length BC is going to be equal to this side length BE. So therefore we conclude that this big triangle CBE is an isosceles triangle since these two side lengths are equal. And now let's recall exterior angle theorem. According to this theorem, the exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of two opposite uh, interior angles. As you can see in this uh, diagram and here this is our exterior angle whereas these A and B are our opposite uh, interior angles such that uh, this angle C equal to sum of these angles A plus B. And now in our case let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, ABE. And we can see that this is our exterior angle and this has got to be equal to the sum of these two opposite interior angle this one and this angle. So therefore this angle has got to be x. And here's our next step. Let's focus on these two triangles BCD and ABE. We conclude that these two triangles are congruent triangles according to side angle side congruency theorem since this side length equal to this side length and this side length AB is equal to this side length CD that has been given to us and the angle between them. Now since these two are our congruent triangles so therefore this angle DBC has got to be 3 times x. And here's our final step. Let's focus on this uh, triangle ABC. And now let's recall uh, triangle sum theorem. The sum of three interior angles in a triangle is always 180 degrees. So therefore in this triangle ABC the sum of this angle, this angle and uh, these angles must be 180 degrees. And we know that this combined angle ACB is going to be x plus 2x is going to give us uh, 3x. Go ahead and write down these three angles 4x plus 3x plus 3x. Let me write down 4x plus 3x plus 3x has got to be equal to 180 degrees. So if we add the left hand side that is going to give us 10x equals to 180 degrees. And now let's divide both sides by 10 to isolate uh, x. So therefore this 10 and 10 is gone. So therefore our angle x turns out to be 18 degrees. So that's our angle x turns out to be 18 degrees. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.